Ever since humans started exploring the universe, Mars has been a constant point of fascination. After decades worth of research and missions sent to Mars, it has been found that the dusty, red planet has a solid surface, large deposits of frozen water, and is speculated to have once had ancient life billions of years ago. So, as we gaze to the stars to expand our living borders, we are continuously reminded that the world beyond the atmosphere is hostile, cold, and cruel. But is there life on Mars? Join us today as we are going to talk about terrifying discoveries made by NASA's Mars rovers over the years and why are scientists so thrilled to find these. And let's get started. As humans are reaching out to Mars and making new discoveries there, NASA's intentions to land astronauts on the Red Planet by 2030 could become a reality one day. However, one of the most difficult tasks is just transporting people over the 3 to 4 million miles of space between Earth and Mars. Humans, on the other hand, will face significant challenges once they get on Mars, which is a harsh, freezing, and hostile planet. Human life on Mars requires water, but the Red Planet doesn't have any or does it. Evidence dating back to the 1970s contradicts this claim when the Mariner 9 and Viking space probes first returned photographs of Mars to Earth. Scientists released a research in Science in 2018 claiming to have discovered a 12-mile-wide lake lying approximately a mile below Mars' South Pole. The U.S. Geological Survey said in the same year that they had discovered eight places on Mars where erosion had exposed significant cross-sections of ice deposits between 1 and 100 meters beneath the planet's surface. While scientists and astronomers have learned a lot about Mars over the last few decades, confirming the presence of life isn't one of them. Mars is both a wonderful and a terrible place to go looking for life, as the researchers now believe that the red planet wasn't always such a wreck. For the first billion or so years of its 4.5 billion year lifespan, it was awash in oceans and seas and protected by a thick blanket of air. Eventually, however, its magnetic field shut down, allowing the solar wind to claw away the atmosphere and the water to vanish into space. But that first billion years offered Mars plenty of time to cook up at least microbial life, some of which may have died and left chemical traces on the surface, or even have retreated underground to continue thriving in deep, warm aquifers. Now, a new study, announced by NASA in the Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, suggests that some of those lingering surface markers of ancient life may have been found, lying in plain sight, in fact. So, let's talk about some of the shocking, amazing, and terrifying discoveries made on Mars over the past few years. A new research, led by geoscientist Christopher House of Pennsylvania State University, was based on work conducted by NASA's Curiosity rover, which has spent the last nine and a half years in Mars' Gale Crater, a one-time lake, studying its rocks and surface sediments in search of clues to the planet's geologic and biologic history. However, Curiosity wasn't designed to detect life but to determine if Mars had all the necessary conditions, such as liquid water, the chemical building block of life, such as carbon, and energy sources that life could use. In the first year of its mission, Curiosity found a site called Yellowknife Bay that once held an ancient lake. From the minerals left behind, scientists can tell that the lake water was not too acidic and not too salty. They also found carbon, nitrogen, sulfur, phosphorus, and other elements that life requires, and perhaps most importantly, Curiosity found potential sources for energy for microbial life there. Curiosity made remarkable discoveries on the planet and laid a strong foundation for the future rovers such a Perseverance rover to work on. Talking about Perseverance rover, it landed on Mars on February 18, 2021, at the Jezero Crater, an ancient lake bed on Mars that offers the best possible chance for finding signs of ancient life. The six-wheeled rover that's as large as a regular car is expected to spend at least one Mars year on the planet, which is approximately 687 Earth days. During its stay on the planet, the Perseverance rover has a main goal of collecting samples and storing them in hermetically sealed tubes which will be collected by future manned missions on the Martian surface. It is equipped with a total of 23 cameras, two microphones that allow capture of Martian winds. The rover also has lasers on board for chemical analysis of the Martian surface. This includes a pixel, planetary instrument for X-ray lithochemistry, an AI-powered X-ray device that hunts for traces of microscopic life from billions of years ago. In its year-long journey to date, Perseverance has discovered the existence of a lake on Mars, as well as carbon-containing organic chemicals in some rocks, hinting at previous life on the now-barren planet. But Perseverance wasn't alone in this journey. 
It was accompanied by the Ingenuity helicopter, the first aircraft to fly on a planet other than Earth. So, let's talk about the discoveries made by Perseverance so far. Number 1. Mars Lost Lake and River Delta Scientists have had proof since 2013 that water once flowed on Mars. When NASA's Curiosity rover found smooth, rounded pebbles like those seen in Earth's rivers on the Martian surface. More recently, it was discovered the Jezero crater area was once flooded with water and was home to an ancient river delta. A 2021 paper on NASA's Perseverance Mars rover mission revealed more details about Jezero's watery past. The rover's images showed steep slopes called escarpments or scarps in the delta which formed from sediment accumulating at the mouth of an ancient river that long ago fed the crater's lake. Discussing the research, Nicholas Mangold, a Perseverance scientist and lead author of the paper, called the discovery a key observation that enables us to confirm the presence of a lake and river delta at Jezero. Number 2. Mars Quakes In July 2021, scientists discovered new detail about Mars makeup thanks to NASA's InSight probe. The probe, which landed on Mars in 2018, has a seismometer that can sense vibrations underneath the ground, and as a result, it was able to take the first recording of a Mars block. From InSight's data, researchers determined that Mars' crust could be 12 miles to 23 miles. Earth, which is nearly twice the size of Mars, has a crust ranging from a few miles to more than 4 to 5 miles. According to NASA, the three papers based on the seismometer's data published in Science, provided details on the depth and composition of Mars' crust, mantle, and core, including confirmation that the planet's center is molten. Earth's outer core is molten, while its inner core is solid. So scientists will continue to use InSight's data to determine whether the same holds true for Mars. Number 3. Volcanic Supereruptions Scientists recently found evidence for thousands of supereruptions, the most violent volcanic explosions known. To do so, they study the topography and mineral composition of a portion of the Arabia Terra region in Mars' northern hemisphere. A paper published in the journal Geophysical Research Letters in July 2021 paints a vivid picture. Spewing water vapor, carbon dioxide, and sulfur dioxide into the air, these explosions tore through the Martian surface over a 500 million year period about 4 billion years ago. Therefore, behaving almost similarly to Earth's volcanic eruptions, it could be a huge sign of life on Mars. Periods of persistent water. Martian rock samples are providing clues about where groundwater, potentially conducive to microbial life, may have once been found on Mars for long stretches. NASA's Perseverance rover collected its first samples from the Jezero crater in early September, and the results astounded many scientists. It looks like our first rocks reveal a potentially habitable, sustained environment, said Ken Farley of Caltech, project scientist for the mission. It's a big deal that the water was there a long time, he added. Number 5. Regional dust storms dry out Mars. According to scientists, regional dust storms play a huge role in drying out Mars. Scientists think Mars contained much more water billions of years ago, but are less sure about the reason for the water escaping. Using three spacecraft, however, scientists discovered one reason. The storms warm up higher altitudes of the cold atmosphere. In the higher reaches of Mars, where the atmosphere is sparse, water molecules are left vulnerable to ultraviolet radiation, which breaks them up into their lighter components of hydrogen and oxygen, NASA explained. Hydrogen, which is the lightest element, is easily lost to space, with oxygen either escaping or settling back to the surface. This proves why life vanished from the planet's surface. Considering all these discoveries, future Mars exploration missions will confront scientists and astronauts with a slew of issues that will put human life in jeopardy. Access to water, dealing with a chilly planet devoid of oxygen, and managing deadly radiation levels are among the most difficult challenges to overcome. However, when humans continue their journey to the moon with an eye on Mars, they will learn to adapt, as they always have, and find fresh answers to the issues that lie ahead. This will mark a new era of space exploration and possibly the discovery of new planets to live just like Earth. And this is it for today, guys. What are your thoughts on today's video? Please share your views with us in the comments below. And also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell icon for more amazing videos about space. And thank you for watching.